Uh, sure. Um, I'm a doctor of clinical psychology, a certified school psychologist, which is what I'm most known for professionally, a certified school principal, a former child therapist, family therapist, which I still do occasionally for different agencies. Um, author of the book, Psychoacademic Holocaust, Special Education and ADHD Wars Against Black Boys. Uh, my second book, my newest book, which is only about two weeks old, is Black Parent Advocate. In addition to that, we're in the process of building a Frederick Douglass and Marcus Garvey Academy, Wilmington, Delaware. We purchased four buildings February of 2019, one week before Frederick Douglass's 201st birthday. And we're in the process of getting the smaller school, which is the Honorable Marcus Garvey building. We're trying here. Uh, we're a little short on the cash. So we're asking brothers. Okay, y'all. So this more. is Donate. the funny. Please, please get on your part. cash app, dollar sign FDMG school. Get on your PayPal, paypal.me slash FDMG Academy or mail in your donation to the FDMG Academy, P.O. Box 9634, Wilmington, Delaware. 19809, former Minister of Education, Marcus Garvey's UNIA, founder of the National Independent Black Parent Association. Education and mental health is what I do, along with the greater goal of international liberation for all African people as a pan-Africanist. Okay, well, let, let's, let's get into a little bit. From that time, when did you start raising money and, and all that, you know... And, when did it all start? When was the, the genesis of I had, EMG school? I had the idea to open a school since I was in college. Most of our children in special ed in America do not have a learning disability. They can read if they want to. They can learn how to do math if they want to. They have a lazy disability, and nobody's making them do their best. And so all of Okay, y'all, now I'm going to turn to the funny part. People feel like, you know, the time that uh, six years is just a very long time to be raising money. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And to and, and to finally get the, the, the bills in that you uh, ended up getting that are in disrepair and all of that. And, and I think it's the transparency that people are looking for. A lot of people are looking for you to be more transparent. And when they don't see this transparency, it makes them feel... You know, skeptical. That's a damn lie. <laughs> okay. Let so, me speak to some of that. Yes, please. Okay. Number one, I'm transparent with my don'ts. I'm transparent. Now, with my I'm, I'm being told that 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 there, you know, people say when your actual donors will ask certain no, things, sir, that's they a said that is you not will true. Sometimes that is block not true. them and all this type of that stuff. That is not true. Those are not donors. Those are haters. My <laughs> donors have direct access to me. I talk to them. I know who they are. Most of them are repeat he donors. He knows who My all donors his donors are. From all. black professionals. I have lawyers. I have engineers. I have business owners all the way down to the retired great grandma. To the grandma, guys. A month because she want to see this plan come to fruition. Haters don't donate. Donors don't hate. Y'all hear that? So my accountability <laughs> is only to those who donate. I want to be very clear about that. It's only to those who donate. So people who ask random questions, they'll never get answers because you don't support this. Now, with that being said, let me also say this. The other question that you ask, which is often asked, is six years, you don't have the school yet. I'm not to blame for that. The community is to blame for that. Y'all are to blame. Do y'all hear that? School out of thin air. Get on your cash money. app. They're not houses. <laughs> They're commercial property. But because we're not used to Building wrong with y'all exclusively with black dollars, we don't understand how long it takes to get that done. I'm not a charter school, I'm not a public school. My school isn't going to subsist on white handouts and government funding. My school is grassroots Pan African Academy, so it'll take as long as it takes until we raise the money to achieve the goal. It is that simple. Why the school ain't up yet because we're not raising enough money. But it's your fault. <laughs> <laughs> the owner of Quaker Grits, because Negroes give them eleven million dollars a year. Guess who don't have to ask that question? Y'all better I get off that grit them. money. Because Negroes give them four billion dollars, two billion dollars a year. Malt liquor, four billion dollars a year. We per 
Herman Beauty products, $30 billion a year. Of uh, fast food, a $1 billion a year. They don't have to ask the Europeans and the Jews and the Chinese and the Arabs. They don't have to ask. Oh, because y'all got to eat. Get that Negro money. This man they can't have his school. Maybe we're feeling like, yo, you know, money is the, is, is the answer for everything. But sometimes it's our resources. How about, yo, you know, could you donate your time or something to... To help, instead of the money to, to fix something, how about y'all come in and, and, and donate your time to, to help build up the school or something like that? You see, it's not always about money. It's about the people that you know. It's about a lot of different things. That's a damn lie. <laughs> um, y'all, you know, you know, that know, is my time, I but like I, I just you had to let y'all hear so that. This is Wet Tunes. Shout out to you. Out you're, I don't know, I don't know who you are, but you're awesome. And, and this is a big <laughs> Love you guys. That Bye. I feel like